produce market is usually empty by late January. The fruit sellers and tofu makers having left Beijing well in advance, not this year. Government-sponsored surveys show about three-fourths of Chinese citizens will not travel home. A steady stream of customers keeps this temperature monitor at the market entrance beeping. Everywhere in the countryside is sealed off, explains my local butcher, who goes by Xiongmang or Panda. Beijing wants anyone traveling to rural areas to do a COVID test when they return to a city, plus do a seven-day quarantine. Chinese villagers are also on the drive. Many have gone into semi-lockdowns already, so Panda's native village in Jiangxi province wouldn't even let them in. Panda 